Welcome back, Sim Racers. Today we introduce you to what may be your new favorite hub. We test if the Fanatec Club Sport version 1.5 handbrake works with the Logitech G920 shifter, pedal, and wheel combo with the Collective Minds Drive Hub. Here we go. Fanatec is one of the industry leaders in sim racing, and the quality shows throughout. It also mounted nicely to my pre-existing rig. Check that out in this video. Currently Logitech does not make a drive hub so you can't add accessories to their wheel pedal and shifter combo as of right now. But this unit, the Collective Minds Drive Hub, has solved that problem. I have been testing this for a few weeks now and I am happy to say that this unit excels and exceeds every expectation that I had on the unit. The drive hub allows you to use almost any combination of wheel, pedal, and accessory on almost any console and is an amazing piece to have in your arsenal of sim racing gear. In order to take advantage of the Collective Minds USB, we needed to turn this 8th inch plug into a USB adapter which the Club Sport has on the Fanatec website. The Club Sport USB adapter needs to be upgraded with firmware from their website. Use the QR code on the back of the package. You have to switch what mode you want the USB adapter to work with. The handbrake, the shifter, or the pedal. Finalize the adapter update. Plug all the corresponding equipment into the drive hub and power up the unit by plugging in the main connection to the console. The hub will recognize all the equipment and set it up properly for the console. Now you can remap the handbrake to any of the supported games on the hub. The remapping can be done in the settings menu of these popular games. The Fanatec handbrake in conjunction with the hub has been working flawlessly. I've been using it in tournaments so far and I've had zero issues with it. The other handbrake would drop out all the time. That's the Amazon one and you can see that one here in the link above. The Amazon handbrake has become very expensive due to demand and supply. So this is the better option I believe and you're supporting these companies who actually are into sim racing. Any questions, leave them down below in the comment section. Subscribe for more comment. Ring that bell of notifications. And happy sim racing, everyone. We will see you out there on the stages. Take care.